CNC Worldwide presents The Syracuse Orange will honor the Louis and Bowie show during the halftime of their ACC game against Pittsburgh on February 21st. Louis Orr and Roosevelt Bowie will have their jerseys retired. The Orange posted a 118 record during their four-year college career. Bowie, who graduated from Kendall High School, and Orr were both part of Jim Beheim's first recruiting class in 1976. Both players finished their careers with more than 1,000 points. Orr tallied 1,487 points with 881 rebounds. He was selected first-team All-Big East as senior and went on to play eight seasons in the NBA. Bowie ended his career with 1,560 points and 987 rebounds and 327 blocks. He still ranked second at SU in all-time shots blocked. He was also named first-team All-Big East in 1980. In high school boys basketball on Friday night, Greece Athena remained undefeated as the Trojans pulled away in the second half to down host Webster Schrader 70-43. Athena is now 12-0 while Schrader fell to 7-4. Anthony Lamb netted 17 points for the Trojans. For the Warriors, Casey Harris scored 16 points. Rush Henrietta improved to 9-2 as the visiting Royal Comets edged host Hilton Cadets 60-58. Shane Fanning led all scorers with 16 points for RH as Steven Sarzak chipped 12 points and 7 rebounds. Reggie Robinson contributed 10 points, 6 rebounds, 6 steals for the Comets. For the Cadets, who dropped to 6-6 six six on the season, Jonathan Letta and Mike Ross combined for 30 points, as each tallied 15. North Star Christian Academy routed Webster Christian 70-41, as the Knights improved to 12-1. Matt Weiner tallied a game high of 15 points for the Warriors, as Zach Bantel added 13 points. Webster Thomas crushed Spencerport 74-29 to go 6-5 on the season. Steve Maleka paced the Titans with 16 points as Drew DiBacco collected 13 points, 6 steals, and 6 assists. Alex Hutchings contributed 9 points and 10 rebounds for Thomas. Penfield defeated Gates Chilai 59-34 at home. Dequan Smith tossed a game high of 18 points as Danny Rogers netted 16 points for the Patriots, who are 4-8 on the season. Gates Chilai dropped at 2-9. In girls high school basketball on Friday night, Rush Henrietta extended its undefeated streak to 12-0 with a 48-37 victory over host Hilton. Dana Watts led the Lady Royal Comets with 19 points as Destiny Johnson chipped in 12 points. The Lady Cadets are now 9-3 on the season. Spencerport upset visiting Webster Thomas by a count of 61-59. Caitlin Broderick recorded a double-double for the Lady Rangers with 18 points and 10 rebounds. She also had 6 assists and 4 steals. Teammate Brianna Campbell scored 16 points, as Michaela Constable added 12 points and 8 rebounds. Jacqueline Marisco scored 10 points for Spencerport. The Lady Titans dropped to 8-3 on the season, while Spencerport improved to 6-7. The Rochester Americans won their second consecutive game on Friday night with a victory of 3-2 over the Adirondack Flames at the Blue Cross Arena. The Amherst lone all-star Phil Verone scored the game winner with 2-16 left in regulation. Only Matt Hackett recorded 21 saves, including a penalty shot and a shorthanded breakaway by the Flames. The game was just the third for Hackett since returning from a knee injury suffered in April while playing for the Buffalo Sabres. The Amherst are on the road for the next eight games and will not return to the Blue Cross Arena until February 13th, also against Adirondack. For the game, story, videos, and interviews, go to any of the CNC Worldwide media platforms. That's the CNC Sports Rock Report for today. This is Topher Jankersio reporting. Come back tomorrow for the CNC Sports Rock Report.